my first semester here was hard for me. And in a sense, I feel like I have a duty to um, make sure that the resources that weren't there, or the connections that weren't there for me are there for future Penn Staters. Um, and I think this is just who I am. Um, I love my family and my family means a lot to me. Um, and my parents took a risk leaving the comfort of their own country to come here because they realized that their community, their country couldn't provide uh, for them for them and for their future family and they took a risk and they left the comfort of their country to come to a foreign land that they didn't know. Um, they gave up so much so that I could have you know the opportunities that I've had today um, and it's that sense of my parents have always told me, my mom and my dad have always told me that we're put in positions where we are today to help the generations that will come after us. Um, they were put in a position where they had the opportunity to come to the United States so that they could help their future family. And I think I'm at a place now where, um, and it's something that I've lived through throughout my life, it's I'm, I'm fortunate to be where I am now, but I'm fortunate to be here because I think that I have a purpose to help those who will come after me and, and you know and the opportunities that will arise tomorrow or in 10 years or in 20 years it's for a purpose and I think that purpose for me is to help people that will come after me um, and you know there's I read I was online I was on uh, you know just surfing the web and a video came up and it's kind of like stuck with me through that day it was a video about this um, poet who was at a protest and he it was a spoken poetry uh, performance and I love spoken poetry. I love it so much. I think it's so passionate. Um, and one of the lines he kept repeating is, I do not have the right to do nothing. And it talks about how Martin Luther King and Cesar Chavez and all these prominent leaders, if what if they didn't do what they did, where would we be today? You know, I don't have the right to just sit here because like I said, my mother and father left their country to give me the opportunity to stay, so I don't have the right to just waste it. Um, not waste it for myself and my family, and not waste, it, not waste it for other people that might come after me. I do not have the right to do nothing, and I'm in positions today to help those that will come after me. Goodbye. <laughs>